Hello everyone, this is Ms. Fatma and in this video I'll be talking about uh, Unit 3 titled Facing the Future, Confronting the Past and this unit will be going over approximately four weeks. So for the unit description and essential questions the essential question is how do our attitudes towards the past and future shape our actions? So whether they illustrate the consequences of greed and ambition or reflect on the passing of years, many classic works of literature have withstood the test of time by exploring a common theme, our relationships to our past past and the future. This unit has been designed, designed to allow you to explore the ways your interpretation of the past and our feelings about the future can influence this, this, the decisions we make in the present. So for the unit goals, for our reading goals, you read a variety of texts to gain the knowledge and insight needed to write about attitudes towards time. You'll expand your knowledge and use of academic and concept vocabulary. You will write a response to a, a literature in which you effectively incorporate the key elements of an argument. You will conduct research projects of various lengths to explore a topic and clarify. Uh, you will maintain a formal style and use trans wo transition words and various syntax to connect parts of a text. In speaking, you will collaborate with your team team to build on the ideas of others, develop consensus and communicate and with that you will integrate audio, visuals and text to present information. So for our main uh, reading piece of literature we will be reading Julius Caesar. You will be writing an argumentative essay. Uh, you will be provided with different topics to choose from. Of course, your writing, you should maintain a formal style. You should use the rules of grammar that we have learned in the varying sentence structure, using correct punctuation, varying, varying sentence beginning. And when we talk about speaking and listening, let's say you're presenting, you will collaborate with your team and in your presentation you will integrate audios and visuals and text in presenting. On your unit page you will have an act practice test test just to see where your level is so you can check that out as well. Uh, your unit is integrated with history, technology, economics and political science. As for the integration of the vision and mission of our school with the theme of the unit, the vision sets the stage for students to face the future with confidence, armed with the knowledge and necessary skills to meet evolving challenges. This is its integration with the vision. As for the mission, the mission statement emphasizes the importance of learning from diverse experiences, learning in the past and present to prepare students for the complexities of the future. Catering to learners' well-being underscores the holistic approach to addressing both historical and future challenges, recognizing the interconnectedness of personal and societal well-being. And finally, for the uh, unit project, you will be uh, in groups. You will be preparing the pre-reading to Julius Caesar. Uh, and doing so, you will give us a background of this tra tragedy. So group one, you'll be working collaboratively in creating a PowerPoint addressing the biography of the real Ju Julius Caesar because we need the historical context to understand the play. 
Group two, you'll be working collaboratively on creating a PowerPoint addressing the main themes in today's Caesar. Group three will be working collaboratively on creating a PowerPoint introducing the main characters in Julius Caesar. And group four will create a PowerPoint addressing the motifs, omens, letters, and symbols in Julius Caesar. will be focusing on opens, omens and letters and women and wives. And group five, you will uh, put together a photo gallery of lay of daily life in ancient Rome. I hope this was useful and thank you for listening.